our producers take pride in their care of the environment. The Oregon Dairy Farmers Association is opposed to House Bill 3427, specifically the Dash 1 Amendment. Our producers have endured four years of low milk prices, and dairy farmers across the country are going out of business at a record rate. We have just over 200 grade-A dairy farms in Oregon, and this bill would negatively impact nearly 150 of those 200 farms. Dairy farms receive a monthly income from the sale of milk, but the cost of production exceeds the income received. Feed costs alone are 50 to nearly 70 percent of the monthly income on a farm. There is no profit to tax. Our struggle is real, and our producers are barely holding on. They're pulling equity from their business to stay afloat. And I can test that my family alone is doing that as well as several others. We understand income from national safety net programs that farmers have paid into, including the Dairy Margin Protection Program and EQIP funding from NRCS would be taxed as income. We appreciate the attempts to include our ag co-ops. However, we have questions about the annual patronage that would be paid out to co-op members. On farm fuel costs, they would be taxed by the distributor and the farmers would pay the added cost. There's already consideration by the legislature to add costs to fuel under House Bill 2020. Hitting our producers with two tax increases would be devastating. We respectfully ask you to reconsider the family-owned farms that would be negatively impacted by House Bill 3427 and the Dash 1 Amendment. Please consider exempting food producers from this legislation. Thank you.